This Fox report blew my mind. They actually gave some detail on Iran's oil industry. Well, Iran's president says his country is willing to halt its uranium enrichment program, but there's a catch. Oh, just that Western nations must do the same. Wendell Gola is live at the White House. Well, Wendell, I understand they chuckled at that suggestion. Off camera, Jane, you're right. White House officials literally laughed at the Iranian offer. On camera, Press Secretary Tony Snow would only say that's not how the UN Security Council resolution reads. Mohammed El Baradai, the head of the International Atomic Energy Agency, says Iran could be six months to a year away from producing fuel for a nuclear bomb. His group is releasing a report tomorrow that will mean tighter UN sanctions on Iran. President Bush used to scoff at the idea of Iran needing nuclear reactors. I kind of wonder why they need one since they got all the oil, but nevertheless, others in the world say, well, maybe that's their right to have their own civilian nuclear power industry. The National Academy of Sciences reported in December, however, that Iran's oil production is actually falling. Its people are using so much that it could have no oil left to export by 2015. Press Secretary Snow says the White House has known for some time that Iran's oil reserves are being poorly managed. Oil production in Iran right now is a fraction of a little more than half of what it was before the revolution. Uh, so it's considerably down. And of course, they do have some they have rising demand, they have uh, low prices, they have subsidized prices. Snow says the world is offering Iran civilian nuclear energy so long as they don't have the knowledge and the materials to produce nuclear weapons. Too bad we don't have a viable solar panel production industry here in America. We could solve the problem by selling them cheap solar panels.